What happened to you? Did you get into an accident? So what does the other guy look like? I was in a fight once. I was walking out of this petrol station and my idiot brother pushed me. And me and my slurpee smashed into the ground. So to get back at him, I smashed his phone. Look, I'm really not interested in talking. You're kind of annoying, so can you like shut the fuck up for like two seconds? I'm just trying to lighten the tension. It might feel better if you tell me what happened. It's bad. How bad? Bad. What if I tell you a secret? Something bad. It's probably worse than what you've done anyways. If I tell you mine, then you tell me yours. And it's fair. Fine. Okay. I ran away from home. You ran away? That's it? I'm not finished. I ran away because I did something bad. Like, really bad. I didn't mean to do it. If you were in my shoes, you would have probably done the same thing. What? Put my house down. Why? Spur of the moment kind of thing. I wasn't thinking. I was just angry. <laughs> At what? Everybody. Ever since my parents got divorced, things have been different. Different houses, different families. But that day my dad came to get his stuff. They didn't even speak to each other. Just doing their own separate things. It had been like that for a while, even when they were still living together. It was just different. Anyways, I was packing up his stuff, and then all of a sudden he looks at me and stares. And it's not like an I'm proud of you kind of stare. It's more like a this is all your fault, kind of stare. After he packed up, he got this call from Air Wrecker. A-I-R-W-R-E-C-K-A. -E I mean, what kind of fucking name is Air Wrecker? I mean, if it's just gonna be pronounced Erica, why not fucking spell it that way? Who's Eric? Are you even listening? Who do you think? It's obviously not his fucking pet! You know, I bet her parents probably named her Air Wrecker on purpose. Because they knew she would turn out to be a home wrecker. Anyways, he got up, walked away, didn't say anything, and just fucking pushed past me. That's when I lost it. That's when you burn your house down? No! Are you even paying attention? What a weird moment to just like blow up your house. He walked past. Like he couldn't hear me. Like I was invisible. Mum wasn't any better. She didn't give two fucks. Just sat there like an idiot now that Ivan was moving in with this stupid new family. I'm sorry. What did you do then? I lost it. I screamed at them. What did I do? Why are you mad at me? I was so angry. When your mom and dad don't love each other and they find new people and then take it out on the kids like, what the fuck? I'm sorry, they had marriage problems, but that isn't my fault. So then because they couldn't hear my obvious screaming, I grabbed some bleach from the laundry and a lighter. But 
time they fucking realized half the house had been burnt down. And where were you in all this? Outside. Watching. How'd you get here then? I didn't want to get arrested for being a pyromaniac. So I left everything and ran. Till I got here. Actually, while I was running away, something kind of weird happened. What do you mean? I don't really know. It was really dark and I couldn't see anything. And then all of a sudden, bam, this bright light hits me and I black out. And then I woke up and then I came here. Okay, so that's the bad thing I did. Now it's your turn. Um, where did you black out? Why? Are you trying to get out of telling your story? Just tell me. <laughs> Jesus. Fine. The last thing... I remember seeing was a playground. Oh, and there was also this really big ass tree. <laughs> Why do you want to know? Because I hit someone with a car. Wow. <laughs> that is pretty bad. <laughs> I mean, I low key thought you were gonna make some big deal out of nothing. Like, you forgot to unpack the dishwasher. Just dishwashers. listen! I was. I was with a few friends, and we'd all had a few drinks. Oh, the captivating and hypnotizing bar of Fuck. alcohol. Fuck! I know my limit. I was, I was the one who had to drive back. But then I was like, what's gonna happen? What's one drink gonna do? And then one became two, and then two became four, and then I, I can't even remember how many I had, and then when it was, When it was time to leave? Fuck. I... I... I didn't even realise how fast I was driving until I heard it. It was a girl. It looked like she was going somewhere. Fuck. I didn't even stop the car to see if she was okay. I just dumped the car and ran away. Fuck. Oh my god. 